Oh, hello, everyone, Sandra here, bringing you a little short news coverage. Um, and by news, I mean something that would really piss people off, and it did, of course. <sighs> we have another idiot oh, trying to trying to uh, pet animals. Like we have in the Nehru Zoological Park in Hyderabad. Sorry, I know I butchered that. Uh, a 35 year old man jumped into the lion den to shake hands with the lion. Whenever was that a good idea to try to shake hands with, or even try to pet, or I don't know, be near wild, savage, carnivore animals? When was that ever a good idea? But no, the man jumped in the lion's den and at that point, I saw the video. I will leave a link into the description for the video so you can see it for yourself. So, the <laughs> the animal keeper strongly advised him and tried to stop him not to do that. He did it anyway. Uh, luckily for him, he jumped in the water and apparently the lions didn't want to go in the water. They didn't want to get wet. Or they smell that that's not a, gu a good human, so why bother eating him? Who knows where he might have been. But he got saved and astonishingly nothing and no one got shot. Amazing, isn't it? Second clip of the day is a music video, to be to be more precise. The company RSA asked politely method designs if they could prepare make a video for the AICP awards coming up. And they blew everyone's mind, especially mine, for example, the, uh, they used, method designs used uh, motion capture technology and then with uh, After Effects, I'm assuming those are After Effects or, yeah, I'll leave a link in the description so you can watch it for yourself, the video is amazing. So different avatars are dancing to Major Laser Light It Up song. It, the song is so good, the visuals are astonishing, you will get your mind blown. Third point of the day, I will be talking about a man called Narayana. Is He's from India, I'm sorry I butchered the name. I, hey, I'm from Europe, what can I say? He came up with the innovative idea of edible cutlery. And he, he didn't really came up, he actually made it. Now, he explains in the video, I'm going to leave the video in the description, a link to it, so you can see it for yourself, and the way he explains it, it got me, like, it, it com totally convinced me. He explains that he ordered food, and then a spoon was put in, like, a normal spoon you wash and you reuse, it was put in, but it was dirty, or it was just with something, right? Uh, normally you could get bacteria there if you, if you don't wash it properly, if you leave it too long in the sun or or just dirty, it doesn't really matter. And he said he had the idea, not just the idea, but actually putting it in practice, edible cutlery. Now spoons and forks, for example, are, are very much used all over the world. So he has the idea of making it nutritious, flavory, and disposable, as in you can eat it. But you, it's not just like for, uh, I don't know, something like hard food. You can actually use it with soups and other different temperature ingredients. I'm not sure if I really want to talk about this. Because every year, or better said, every almost six months, not even six months, it's now something regular that teens do. And I swear to you, the title is like this. Thousands of college girls run around in underwear at UCLA University. I think it's a university. It's university. And it's called the Undie Run. Like, how did something like this came into fruition? How many frat boys did it take to think about that? Okay, how can we get more naked girls or in bikinis or in swimsuits or or something to run around and 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 we can watch them or you know whatever. I watched the video and I can't even wrap my mind around it like why exactly? 
but I'm gonna leave a link in the description so you can check it out for yourself. And for our last segment, I will share this video with you of a guy shooting his father with a, with a Nerf gun every single day. And that's how he reacts. Well, I'm not gonna share it here on my channel, I'm gonna leave a link in the description. Because I wouldn't really like to get the problem with my channel. So, yeah, check it out for yourselves. I actually find it pretty funny and, and pretty hilarious. We're, we're gonna end the video on this happy theme. Um, and yeah, I have decided next time. To oh, don't forget to leave a like if you enjoyed the video. Please leave a comment below any news you would like me to, to review, to share my two cents upon. Yeah. Why leave not? in the description below, Let's not in the description, in the comments below. Uh, and yeah, so the next time. I 